Ah, oh, man, I'm so bored. Yeah, we kind of are doing nothing, aren't we? Yeah. Wish something interesting would happen. Uh, yeah, let's hope someone chips in after me. Whose turn is it? Yeah, there's usually a fifth person that talks. Bon Bon! Hey, Bon! He's asleep? Why the heck is he asleep? Huh, surprised he managed to just doze off like that, especially with how loud you are. With how loud I am? I'm not loud! Ow. Okay, well, yeah, that's not the point. Do you want to wake him up? Let me do it in the most Fun Time Freddy way possible. Oh, wake up! It's not working. Ooh, I've got an idea. Hold on, let me go grab something. Hmm, wonder what our idea is. All right, guys. Meet the one and only Air Horn! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, where the heck did you get that thing? I don't know. It's just kind of tucked away in a random junk drawer. Anyway. Ooh! It's a tube! with a hole at the end of it. How about I use it? So are you suggesting that we just kind of blow it in his ear and wake him up? I like where this is going. Yeah, why don't I do it? All right, Freddy, hold your ears. Okay. Okay, just do it, who gives a crap. All righty, here goes nothing. Three, two. My large, fragile ears. Bon Bon, your ears aren't even as big as mine. I mean, proportionate to my body, you dunce. What the heck was that? <laughs> oh, we woke you up with an air horn. Yeah, Bon Bon, you were sound asleep. You were like, <sighs> yeah, what she said. God. <sighs> Do you know how hard it is to sleep around him? Uh, how so? I don't know. Sometimes he just snores really loudly, only on the right side of his mouth for some reason. What? I don't do that. Me 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 You guys ruined my like one chance to sleep. Who cares, Bon Bon? Let's just go do something. You know what? No, I'm gonna go do Bon Bon things like sleep. I don't even know why I stay on your stupid hand anyway while we're going to bed. Because we're friends forever, Bon Bon! No, I'm not doing this today. <sighs> Screw this. Bon Bon, come on! B bon Bon, I'm, I'm sorry, you can come back. No, screw this. You guys ruined my morning, you and ruined my sleep, and I'm gonna still do my own thing. Bon Bon things. Because guess what? I'm my own person, my own man, and I can do whatever I- <laughs> What happened? Shit. Uh, maybe he's, maybe he's still okay. Uh, maybe he could, he could, he could survive that. Whoa, watch out guys, I got a helicopter for some reason. Oh no. Ugh. Ow. Whew. Good thing I came out mostly unscathed out of that. Hope there was nothing important under that big pile of rubble. Why are y'all looking like that? <sighs> Do you guys think Bon Bon's going to be okay? I... I really don't know, Ballora. <sighs> you seem to be taking this fairly well. What? Why wouldn't I? Bon Bon's gonna be fine. Besides, me and him stick together through everything, and through thick and thin, and all in all, and you know, we could never separate like that anyway. Be fine. I don't know, Freddy. That looked pretty bad. So what if there was a little bit of the truck, and then the rubble, and then the explosion, and the helicopter? It's fine. It'll be fine. Everybody survives that. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just a scratch. It's a flesh wound. Be fine. <laughs> I came as soon as I heard. Oh, Bonnet. Oh my god. I, I, are you alright? Yeah, I just I had to travel here really fast, you know? Ooh, it took a lot out of me. Oh, I see you got that vocal surgery and all that we recommended. Oh, yeah. People don't find me nearly as annoying as they used to. It's actually been really nice. Thank you. Yeah, you're certainly a lot easier on my ears. Yeah, Bonnie, you sound great. You're not nearly as ear grating, you know what I mean? Freddy, maybe you should get some of that vocal surgery, too. Why? No reason. So do you guys think Bon Bon's gonna be okay? Uh, well, there was a little bit of the... bit of the... bit of the... and then also the... and then also the... and then the... so, you know, I... 
I don't, I don't know. Oh, guys, I think the doctor's coming. Wait, seriously? Bob on! Hello. Oh, hey, Andy Unit. <laughs> Where's Bob on? About that. Well, I've got some good news, and I've got some bad news. Which one do you want to hear first? Uh, the good news. I like good news. Well, the good news is that your hospital bill for this visit is a whopping zero dollars. Wait, seriously? Why? Oh, that's because he's dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Bon, Bon, no! Oh my god. Bon, Bon. Oh no. So, would you like the body for Hero to go? We could place it in a disposable Ziploc bag if you'd like. Uh, um, for to go, please. Why would we need the body again? Oh, so you can have the right to decide if you'd want to bury it or cremate it. It's all standard hospital procedure. <laughs> Freddy, I'm so sorry, Freddy. <laughs> Alrighty, here you are. Thank you. Oh god, I'm happy I can't see this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Maybe we should let Freddy see that. <laughs> see what? <laughs> okay, okay. Thank you, doctor. My pleasure. Have a nice day. Do you think he'd want to be cremated? I, I don't know. We didn't. Does he even have a will written? A will written? A will written? Yes, yes, will written. That's the word I'm trying to say. I, I, don't, I don't know. Barnett, do you think you'd know if he had a will? I don't know. I don't think he ever got around to writing one considering he would die so young. <laughs> you know what, guys? Since Barnett and Freddy are the ones that were closest to him, how about we give them some time to grieve and they can decide what to do with him? Yeah, that's a good decision. Barnett, would you be okay with taking it? That'd be nice, actually, yes. That'd be really nice. All right. He's all yours. God, that is just morbid. I don't remember this happening at Springtrap's funeral. Well, they also never found his body, so... True, it did burn up in that building. How about we give them some time to mourn? Come on, guys, let's go. Yeah. Bye, guys. I'm so sorry. <sighs> <sighs> okay, um... Freddy? How about we both sit down and we can decide what to do with the body? <laughs> okay, okay. I, gu I guess we can mourn a little more too. But we should probably get moving soon at some point, right? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Just, 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 just five more minutes. Three weeks later. <sighs> Hopefully three weeks is enough time to give them to mourn. Yeah, shame what happened, but, you know, we all gotta live, learn, and move on. Very true, very true. Hey guys, how's it go? Oh my god. <laughs> Baby, help me. Huh? What, what's been going on? Okay, hold on, let me just, 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 just pry you two apart real quick. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, oh, I need a shower. What, what, what's been going on? I... You guys just, I mean, I understand it's kind of difficult to move on. I, I assumed you guys would have made a decision by now. No, it's not that. <laughs> Freddy has been holding me hostage and crying for like three weeks straight. Oh my god. Jesus. Freddy, are, are you okay? I thought you were going to take this a little better. <laughs> I didn't even know we could cry that much. Um, Freddy? Uh, Freddy? Freddy? Hello? <whistles> Freddy? <laughs> Freddy, we need to do something about Bon Bon's dead body or it's just going to continue to decompose in that plastic bag. Can you please stop crying for five seconds so we can figure this out? I'm convinced his brain's just stopped working. Alright, I've been in this situation before. Give me a second real quick. Acrobatic skills at work. Uh, Funtime Foxy, what are you doing? Alright, let me just do this. Alright, one... Two... Uh, what is she doing? Oh boy. Three! <laughs> Show times are on the hour, not a moment before and not a moment later. Thank you, thank you, you're too kind. Oh, so you just knocked him out.
Yep, applied all my force to my one pinky finger and knocked him right out. Do you think he's gonna be crying when he wakes back up? Hopefully not. Ugh, what happened? Ugh, I feel like my eyes have been dehydrated severely. Uh, Fetty, do you remember about what's happened the last three weeks? Uh, yeah. Bon Bon's is gone. What am I gonna do? Um, Freddy, uh, I know that's a topic, but we do need to figure out what we're gonna do with his body. What's the point? I can't go on. I might as well just get in the bag with him. Freddy, 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 Freddy. Okay, if Bon Bon were here, he would probably want you to keep living on without him and not stuffing yourself in his body bag. You might be right. <laughs> so, um, any ideas? How about we just give him a proper burial? I think that's best that we can do. We can go to the graveyard, put him next to a spring trap, and that other kid that Glamrock Freddy buried. It wouldn't be that bad. Right? It'd be a nice little place. We could put some flowers around, just generally make it nice. Yeah. Um, blue and pink. Those are his favorite colors. I swear that's not just a me thing. He really just liked pink for some reason. <sighs> yeah. Okay. What about you, Freddy? No! No, 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 we're not burying him, we're not cremating him, we're not doing any of that. There has to be, there has to be another way. There has to be something else we can do. What? To the television, that's where all my problems are solved. Uh, Freddy, uh, listen, okay, listen, Freddy, there's, there's usually one of two things you do when somebody dies. You guys hear, here, look, the television. Freddy, I don't see how this is going to solve our problem. Watch, watch, watch. Hi there. I'm scientist, see? There's a right on that sign right there, scientist. Basically... I had two of my dear, dear, sweet kitties pass away a couple weeks ago. Of course, but God rest their souls. But actually, not even. Because, basically what I did, I brought them back to life. I, I did. That's what I did. See, right there. I brought them back to life with my science powers. Meow. <coughs> okay, whatever might have been a dog. But it's fine. You know what I mean? It's fine. Basically, I did what every dig dang dirt darn din darn rotten American do on this planet and capitalized on this. So, if you ever have a have a, have a cow's pet or a cat or something that dies, bring it to me and I can probably bring it back to life. I don't know, they might be missing a couple organs, but they'll be alive and they'll be right back with you, right in your sweet little home. You can pet them, you can feed them, you can do all y'all want with them because they've been ding dang darn alive and stuff. So, come on down to my shop and you can do that. So, yeah, do that. I had an idea! Okay, Freddy, there's two things. First of all, Bonnie is not a cat. Yeah, he's a cat! Look, he, he went meow and stuff, remember that? No, I'm, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure Bon Bon was a rabbit like me. Hey, look, he go meow, meow! I think Freddy's insane. Even more than usual, and that's scary. But Freddy, maybe we just shouldn't do this. No, I got this, guys, it's fine. It'll be fine. Bon 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 is fine. He'll be okay, he'll go meow, and he'll be alive and stuff again. And he can go back on my head, and things will be all hunky-dory again. Freddy, I... I really don't think this is a good idea, especially since, I don't know, I don't know if this is what Bon Bon would want. He'll be fine. Come on, Bonnet, let's go on an adventure. Wait, Freddy, I really don't think this is a good idea. Freddy, Freddy! Oh god, his hands really strong, guys! Help! Should we go after them? I think Bon Bon... I think Bonnet will knock some sense into him. Yeah, she's strong, she can find a piece of candy, and then... She's real strong when she has sugar. Should be able to get you some sugar, right? I hope so. Hey, Big Bag Boom, he's alive again. Little kitty. Meow. Oh my God, sir, you did it. You fixed the bug, my poor cat thing. Mwah. Uh, don't do that. That's okay. Anyway, I'm gonna take my cat. Thank you so much, sir. I'll bill you, you can bill me in the mail. Okay, I don't know how to do that, but I got a tax accountant right over there that can do that for me. Can you do that for me? Yeah. Okay, great. Ow, 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 ow. Hey, how are you doing? Oh, and I thought I was the craziest person in Dustin Airlines. What you got for me, son? Can you bring it back to life, please? Uh, okay. Is this a cat or a dog? There's the only two things I really know how to do. Maybe a goldfish, actually. They're pretty easy. Sir, don't listen to anything he has to say. He's crazy. Nah, no, that's my friend Bon Bon. He died in a car accident about three weeks ago, and I need him to be alive again. So please do that for me. I, I don't, I don't know. I, that, that, that pink rabbit lady behind you is telling me you're crazy and stuff. Shut up, big dude. She's not real. Get her out of here. I do this. Do this for me. Ugh. Freddy, Freddy, I'm serious. This is really, really not a good idea. No, we're doing this. Freddy, I'm serious. This is not a good idea. Shut up. So ah! we doing it or not? Uh, well, seeing as there's no other voice or reason here now to tell me no, I'm gonna do it. All right, I'll see what I can do. All uh, right, just, uh, just stay here for about uh, 15 minutes. I'll be right back. Okay.
Stop bothering me! Oh, wait. Oh, she, she's gone already. I forgot I threw her away. <sighs> Any second now, Bonnet will knock some sense into Freddy, and they'll be right back here. Yeah! Well, hey, look, it's Bonnet now! Really? I don't see her. Oh, you have to hear her! She's up there! What? That was scary. Whoa, what happened? Bonnet? Oh. Guys, guys, Freddy's about to do the thing and I couldn't stop him. What? Freddy's, no, no, we can't do that. That's not, no. Bonnet, I thought you were strong and stuff. I mean, I am when I have sugar, but uh, you see, the thing is, uh, I've been uh, kind of off that diet for a while now and I really don't want to break that. Jesus, how far do you throw you? Pretty far, and I think his strength is kind of extra because you know he's just human stuff. Oh God, we gotta go! Let's go! Let's go! Leave for me! And put on the finishing touches, and done. Alrighty, my scientific brain has done it again. Here's Miss Brandon's. Uh, you got to wait about three hours to unwrap him, though. Uh, normally, I don't do this, but uh, it was a little bit more cutting than normal. So yeah, just about three hours, and he should be just perfect. Thank you, kind sir. Hang on, do you want me to bill me in the mail, or are you going to give me money now? There you go! Oh my god, I'm rich! Let's go! Yay, everything will be perfect again! We don't have to wait anymore! Whee! Well, thank you, kind sir! Dang, this is way more than I normally ask for, like a hundred dollars, two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars, four hundred dollars, five hundred dollars, six hundred dollars, seven eight, nine thousand, thousand, ten, where, <laughs> where, 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 you got about that wire bear and just walked out here about five seconds ago? Yes, actually, I just got done with the procedure, brought a little friend back to life. Wouldn't have made it, just why? Can I do it? Uh, sure, Ballora. You can beat the crap out of him, I guess. Uh. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, where's Freddy now? I don't know. Wait, wait, if he did it, maybe this isn't so bad, actually. Maybe Bon Bon's actually alive. I mean, I guess, but is he even going to be the same? Is he going to have the same memories? I don't know, but those cats look not fine and normal. Maybe everything's okay. I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> I am the local police officer. Wait, seriously? Yes, and that man in the blue over there is under arrest. Thank you, citizen, for entertaining him. <laughs> why, why, why? You're coming with me. <laughs> don't be teleporting! Why? Thank you, kind citizens. I don't know if that's your money, but I take it if it's yours, I guess. Wait, 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 wait. What is the guy under arrest for? Oh, it's gotta be because he was bringing those things back to life, right? I mean, is that really illegal? Actually, no. He was sued because he has under false advertising. He actually did not bring those things back to life. Hey, what? But we saw the cats on TV. You may think you did, and you did see cats that were alive and living, but actually what he does is he skins the animal dead bodies of all the things that he finds and puts them on already living animals. So those are actually just different cats wearing his dead cat skin. It's pretty disgusting, actually. Uh-oh. Why uh-oh? Oh, guys, do you think I know what's about to happen, right? Oh, no. <sighs> Finally, my best friend. Everything can go back to normal now. Now I can finally reveal my best friend to the world! I mean, it hasn't been three hours, but it's fine, whatever. <laughs> Hi, Bon! Bon? Meow. 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 Uh, this is not Bon Bon. What are you doing, you small creature? Get out! Where's my friend? Did you eat him? Did you eat my friend? Phony man, he just fed my friend to that cat! Now I'm never gonna get Bon Bon back! <laughs> His head's poking out of there! I gotta save my buddy! Meow! Meow! Oh, I need my friend's help. Wait, but I brought Bon Bon back to life without their mutual consent. Oh, they're gonna be so mad at me. Oh no, what am I gonna do? Hmm. Think fun, I'm Freddy. How can you have your cake and eat it too? <sighs> this is hard. I got it! I'll get the help of an equally insane different friend! Foul beast, you shall not hurt me. 
Come back, I need you. I need you to come with me. Aw, you're kind of cute, actually. If you hadn't made my friend! Don't worry, I've got this. All right, little thing, we're going to Ennard's house. We have arrived to Ennard's house. <sighs> Mr. Butters, I cannot believe that you drove my brand new helicopter into a dump truck. Look, look, I'm sorry, Ennard. It was just so fun. And then it just kind of spun out of control and maybe hit the dump truck and it exploded. Ugh, whatever. Oh, I found out Freddy. Mi amigo, mi chum. Hey, so look at this little thing. Why is the cat a Bon Bon's face? Oh, you see, this cat actually ate Bon Bon. So we need you to help me out and get him out of there. Freddy, that's... I don't... Freddy, okay, I'm pretty sure that that cat has Bon Bon's face stitched onto it. Not... I don't think it ate it. So you're saying that this cat is Bon Bon? Not really. Kinda. Maybe. Not really. No, no, no. No, no, no. That's just, that's just the cat with Bon Bon's face. Look at where's Bon Bon! Freddy, if I had to guess, I think somebody stitched Bon Bon's face onto a cat. How did this even happen? Oh, well, you see, Bon Bon died. So I wanted to bring him back to life, and this guy said he could bring people back to life. And then so I brought Bon Bon's dead body to him, and then he gave me something wrapped in bandages, and it was this stupid cat thingy. Ow! <sighs> hey, don't hurt the little thing. Jesus Christ, Freddy, it's still a living animal, even if it's not Bon Bon. Okay, I didn't say I liked you that much. You're still kind of freaky. You're still some guy with my dead friend's face on it. <sighs> that guy scared me! I just gave him, like, all my savings and all my monies and all of it. It's all his now, and it's not mine anymore, because I gave it to him. <laughs> and what am I going to do? Hmm. There is one way. What? Since this cat has Bon Bon's face on it, I could just grab some of the DNA off the cat's Bon Bon face, Put it in a cloning machine. And then once I put that in the cloning machine, we should have a new bonbon. Bon. A new bonbon? Bon? But I want my old bonbon bon back. Ah, uh, well, sorry, Freddy. It's, he's dead, and now his face has been mutilated onto a cat. So I don't think we're getting your old bonbon bon back. Uh, I guess it's better than nothing. Great. I'll start up the cloning machine. Come on, little guy. Meow. This is your fault. Wait, what? I, I didn't know that bonbon bon was under the garbage truck. This is your fault for getting hit by a car. <laughs> I win. What's it sound? Oh my god, Bonnie, what are you doing? Why can't you? I found some lifesavers in my car. Freddy, how could you do that? Oh my god, is Bonnie Bonnie like a freaking cat now? Stop it, it's fixing it! What? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let me explain. Let's just. just... Okay, I'm sorry, okay? I think maybe just today I haven't been in the right state of mind because my best friend died. And you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna take that very well. And you know, I'm just, I'm, I'm sorry guys. I acted irrationally and, and I, I didn't take especially Bonnet's feelings into consideration because you know, it's her brother at all and just my best friend and blah, blah, blah. And... I mean, Freddy, you did arguably spend more time with him. It's not about blood, but either way, yes, we both should have probably had equal share in that and you pretty much took all of it. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I acted irrationally and Bon Bon, is just, I'm just so sad that Bon Bon's dead and all and I just miss him so much. He's my best friend. Well, Freddy, we all handle grief in different ways. You were insane with it, but you know, I mean, we all handle grief in different ways. But none of that matters anymore, huh? Huh? Everyone, meet Bon Bon 2. Hey guys. Bon Bon! Oh, hey, Freddy. Oh, it's been a little bit, huh? Does that cat have Bon Bon's face on it? Oh, yeah, um, well, I kind of feel bad for this little thing, and I know nobody, no other sensible person would take it in, so I guess I have a pet cat now. Thanks, guys. Meow. Okay, it is a little cute, admittedly. Still gonna have to get used to the whole dead friend's face on it. Wait, 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 so how's Bon Bon alive? I just cloned him, and now he's also a girl, so get used to that. Wait, what? Uh, it's kind of a 50-50 shot, so, uh, I'm a girl now. <laughs> Hi, Bonnet. Hi, Bon Bon. I guess we're sisters now. <laughs> oh, God, now the gender-bent Bon Bon has no point. Shut up! <laughs> Glad to have you back, little bro. Sis, God, I'm not used to that. Yep, you can blame the character encyclopedia for this one. Bon Bon, are you mad at me? Well, uh, you did nothing personal to me, considering I'm just a clone with, like, the very bare minimum memories of the original Bon Bon, but... Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm not mad. I rode your hand all the time, dude. We gotta be best friends somehow, right? Right? Like, how did he die anyway? Um, it was really unfortunate, actually. Oh, he just so happened to not be looking both ways when he crossed the street and just got hit by a car. Such a shame. Oh, man. I'm gonna have to make sure I don't repeat his mistake again. Guys, this feels really immoral, and I'm the one that's saying this. What is he talking about? Nothing, dear God. Let's just let this go back to normal. I'm gonna get back on your hand now. Yay! <sighs> the world is healing. You know, I never understood this. Why do you get such a strange hunchback whenever Bonbon bon gets off your hand? It's a condition! Ugh, oh, what happened? Hello, Bonbon. Bon. It's me, God and stuff. Oh, hey, God. So, what's going on? Well, uh, hate to break it, pal, but you, you, you kind of died. Oh, that's what that was? Jesus. Well, let's hope somebody didn't brutally mutilate my corpse. Uh, yeah, let's go with that. So what now that I'm dead and all? I'm never going to get to see my friends again? I mean, kind of, but up here I allow everyone to make their own heaven, so you can actually just go back to your own life. I mean, not the same life, a duplication of that life, but you can even make it so you didn't remember any of that happened. It's like you're not even dead. It's pretty cool, actually. Oh, great. Uh, but what's going to happen to all my friends down there, now that I'm dead and all? I'm sure they'll figure it out. Thanks. I guess I'd like exactly what you described, actually. That'd be perfect. Great. Okay, goodbye, Bon Bon. Bye, God. Man, that guy's super chill. Whee! This is canon now.